Hello everyone and welcome to the live session of SAP Cloud Integration. This is your trainer Anu. So today we are going to discuss about what is this integration suite and what is the difference between integration suite and SAP Cloud Integration. So what is this integration suite? This SAP integration suite is basically, it is an integration platform as a service that is nothing but an IPaaS that allows you to smoothly integrate on-premise and cloud-based application and process with tools and pre-built content which is managed by SAP. This service basically runs in SAP BTP or Cloud Foundry environment. There are uh, certain features are there for this integration suites. I mean like uh, for example, I mean like you can see the design and operate integration scenario, then design, develop and manage APIs. Enable connectivity of applications, use integration packs, then simplify mapping implementation and manage integration with trading partner and all. So let's go uh, one by one. What is this uh, design and operate um, integration scenarios? Under this, basically, our cloud integration comes and this brings basically uh, together uh, disparate uh, systems and IT landscapes to streamline your business process and increase efficiency. Now second is design, develop and manage APIs. This is basically a API management where you are going to develop, uh, publish, promote and overse oversee APIs in a secure and scalable environment. Now the third one is enable connectivity of applications this basically refers to open connector where we are going to choose with the pre-built connectors from a catalog to seamlessly integrate sap and non-sap applications then we have a uh, use integration packs here this cloud integration will come here basically we are going to accelerate uh, integration uh, development with out of the box integration packs for an end to end scenarios such as hire to retire, lead to cash or procure to pay uh, and, and many more. Then we have a simplify mapping implementation. Here uh, integration advisor will come and where I mean the purpose of this one is basically develop business oriented interface and mappings by using cloud sourcing and machine learning and all. Then the last one is manage integration with trading partner. So this uh, refers to trading partner management where you are going to create, maintain, execute and monitor business to business scenarios. Then we have, uh, then I mean we can go for uh, this uh, uh, capability of, uh, so under this capabilities of integration suite, so we have a cloud integration, API management, open connector, integration advisor, then TPM is nothing but trading partner management and integration assessment and all. Uh, this uh, cloud integration is nothing our own CPI and all, which is basically integrated between SAP and non-SAP applications and all whether it's a cloud or on-premise uh, uh, system and uh, and basically I mean like a spanning which under I mean like which can be have a different organization or department or can be under the one organization. Then we have API management which is usually uh, to get access to uh, uh, simple scalable and secure digital assets through application management interface that is nothing and APIs and consume these. Then we have a open connectors. Uh, this basically builds seamless integration with over 160 non SAP application using pre built connectors. Then uh, we have integration advisor. Uh, 
Uh, here basically it accelerates the development of business oriented interfaces and mapping and it generates uh, runtime artifacts quickly and significantly uh, to reduce the efforts and all. Then we have a TPM. This is basically used to manage the B2B relationship with multiple trading partners through this easy to use user interface that has simplified the B2B communication between trading partners and all. And the last one is the integration assessments. This basically define integration landscape based on integration solution advisor methodology, nothing called a IC, ISAM. Now we we'll see uh, like uh, now we'll go for uh, this uh, uh, SAP CI, our SAP CI is nothing, cloud platform integration that we have already discussed, that we have already seen in the previous, what is the use of this one to basically connect time in uh, SAP and non-SAP cloud and uh, like on-premise applications and all. And um, again, I mean like uh, this can be, I mean your application which uh, can be, I mean like an, under one organization or can have a outside of the organization and all or can, can go for multiple organization. Uh, then what are the features for that one? So the first one is that implement diverse scenarios. What does this mean? Basically, it integrate process and data in application to application, a thing called A to A and business to business, B to B scenarios. Then it is going to connect to multiple endpoints. Under this one, it integrate uh, various application and data sources from SAP and non-SAP, uh, on-premise as well as cloud. Then SAP cloud integration comes with a set of pre-built adapters. Now, uh, again, I mean the features will be like custom SAP integration scenarios. So. Uh, under this one, like a benefit from pre-packaged integration content to jump start integration uh, projects and to set up pro productive uh, scenarios with only minimum effort. You can extend predefined integration flows according to your organization requirement. Then we have a develop custom adapters. This is basically used to uh, use, I mean, it is used uh, the adapter SDK to build your own custom adapters for additional connectivity needs if required. Then you can access public APIs and all, nothing to be uh, defined, nothing to elaborate. Then we have a setup secure and reliable communication. Basically use our, uh, look, use our core integration and security capabilities for the safe and reliable processing of messages. Uh, this is used to configure the way how messages are exchanged between an integration scenario so that the data involved is protected according to the latest security standards. Then we have a features like implement various communication modes. And the last one is integrate the SAP process orchestration. So use SAP cloud integration and SAP on-premise integration platform. SAP process or question seamlessly integrated under this one. Now, what is the difference between SAP cloud integration and what is uh, and uh, uh, and integration suite? So, uh, as I have already told, uh, what is integration? Uh, what is cloud integration? And what is uh, uh, integration suite? So this cloud integration, nothing. It is one of the service of SAP application, SAP integration suite. Uh, I mean, like you have open connector, like, like you have SAP APIs, TPM and all integration as well. Similarly, it is one of the service of integration suite. This integration suite contains many other applications that I already told you like API management, integration device, open connector and trading partner management and all. So here also you can see here I have seen I have shown you the pictorial representation of uh, this integration suites 
where you can say this build integration scenario is in nothing uh, called your cloud integration. And here you can see APIs and all. Similarly, you can see APIs and all, then open connectors and all. So this is uh, this is what actually I have tried to uh, give you uh, uh, overview of like uh, integration suite and cloud integration. Also, I try to tell you uh, the difference between integration suite and cloud integration. Yeah. That is for the today's. Um,